Hello guys, thanks for watching, Adrian here from Epson. So in this video I will uh, explain how to use the Django Vault uh, Pro dashboard. Uh, I will um, use the product in my local environment, install the modules, start up the application, create the super users, a super user and also um, edit my, my profile as a, as a common user. So for newcomers, uh, the Vault dashboard is built on Bootstrap 5. It's provided by, by Tinsberg and also Django. It's a super powerful uh, backend framework used uh, uh, that is super mature with a strong ecosystem and uh, many, many programmers that, that su supports the, this amazing, amazing library. <clears throat> okay, let's go. Uh, I have already the source code uh, downloaded in my, in my environment. So once you uh, go with the purchase, with the product, you just, uh, you have access to, to this, uh, to the zipper chip and you need to unzip it. And uh, also um, need to follow up the, the build instructions uh, as provided on the readme file. So the best thing that you can do once you have access to the source code, uh, jump in and uh, into the source code, uh, open up the readme and learn how to use the product. So I will just uh, uh, create a virtual environment. Um, I will activate the virtual environment. Okay, now the modules are, are all um, installed. So uh, the product comes with a few nice features like um, uh, social authentication for GitHub and Twitter, uh, extended user profiles, um, transactions module and tasks module. All the features are, are listed here on the, um, on the pricing, on the pricing card. So you, we can see that uh, the modules are available in all, uh, in all licenses. And um, we have here an improved authentication, uh, which means uh, in case of uh, any users are um, you know, providing a wrong password, they are automatically suspended. Uh, social authentication uh, for GitHub and, and Twitter, extend the user profiles that allows the registered users to add more information about them, uh, like address, like city and uh, country and also upload their uh, uh, their profile image can be updated using an external FTP storage um, users management in case uh, you are authenticated as a super user you are able to delete accounts edit the information suspend unsuspend users uh, task modules and transaction modules and uh, specialized are specialized things that uh, allows you to, to manage tasks and distribute tasks across the uh, applications users and also transactions in case you have a minimal e-commerce you'll see here the, the transactions and you can manage all the, all the information okay let's go back to the to the application and uh, check out the um, the progress uh, the application comes with uh, many many modules okay so now the modules are installed uh, the next thing is to um, is to execute the migration i will uh, migrate all the all the applications In case uh, someone lands on the on a bug, uh, just uh, uh, chat with support and uh, we will assist. Uh, some issues might occur in the documentation, but uh, uh, for those that are new to AppSeed, uh, go here to the support page. The link is also provided uh, here on uh, on the home page because we want to assist the, the, all the community. So feel free to use the um, uh, credentials provided here on support and uh, chat with us and us an email or simply jump in uh, Discord and uh, for uh, live one-to-one -one assistance. Okay, I will go back to the, to the application uh, tasks. Let's uh, migrate also the transactions. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, so the database is migrated. Let's create a super user. <clears throat> okay so i have a super user created and uh, now we can uh, we can start application and uh, play with uh, application features okay now if we go here Okay, let's create a new account. Test me. Test me at fsweep.us. I will put here password. We can visualize the password and also copy here the, the field in case we want to update it. Uh, we can use this uh, minimal widget to, to copy the, the field the value of the password in the confirmation uh, in the confirmation box so i will uh, register the, the user we have a successful message let's uh, uh, authenticate so we're in the application we just created the user authenticate uh, what we can do from from this point we can uh, go here and update the information this is the extended uh, profile uh, feature let's uh, update the uh, the image of the current user this feature is uh, is activated once um, uh, once we have in the uh, in the environment um, the ftp credentials so basically the application saves this image using this uh, information here which uses uh, FTP storage and uh, we need to provide of course user password whatever in order to to have a successful uh, authentication once the image is uh, is uploaded um, we should see here that uh, green message in the page and um, the, the image is persistent this is the transaction module we have here some some charts some plotted charts also integrated so uh, this is the this is the the basic features of the of the app um, let me authenticate also as a super user so the account was super I think okay I'm in so if you are a super user you have this users list available so uh, you can uh, edit, suspend, and suspend users. So basically, I can update any user um, registering the application. For instance, I will uh, uh, suspend this uh, user that I just created. Let me uh, open up another another window and uh, explain. Okay, so uh, the user that we created it was this me with strong password okay so the the login is is usable i will log out and go here into the um, uh, as a super user in this uh, window i'm super user and i will uh, suspend the user here and if we try to uh, log in again with this user we should have this uh, message that informs us that we are suspended of course, um, as super users, uh, we can unsuspend the user, and um, it's all good. And right now, we should be able to authenticate. So it's all good. So guys, um, thanks for watching. This is the application. It has a lot of things. Uh, the UI looks good. It's designed by Tisberg. Um, the product um, uh, is under Black Friday uh, offer, so feel free to uh, take a look in case you want to to grab a, a nice deal. 
let us know what you think. Um, in case you need support, just go here and uh, chat with us, send us an email and uh, tell us what you think about the product. Adrian here from Mapsid. As always, I wish you all a super, super day and uh, see you on the next video. Bye, guys.